Day two of our Today Food All-Star Thanksgiving, we are pairing chefs and dishes yes. to help you create a really memorable holiday feast. And this morning, we have sweet and savory recipes from debutante farmer Elizabeth High School <laughs> and Jocelyn Delk Adams, who's founder of Grand Baby Cakes, the blog. Ladies, good morning. Good, good morning. morning. So you, you, we had a lot of different options here, but you chose yes. one ingredient. Just, mm -hmm. You're going to make a couple of different ways. Right. So what's our ingredient? So, well, it's, cor it's cornmeal. Oh. And um, I look for any excuse to make cornbread dressing. Yes. And so, honey, we jumped on it, and she and I gotta make it sweet, baby. Yes, okay. I know. That's what we, do. we don't invite grandbaby cakes for just nothing. Okay. Okay. Exactly. <laughs> so we're gonna start with our cornbread here. Okay. We have our self-rising flour. We've got our self-rising meal. We're gonna whisk up some eggs. If you want to do that for yep, me, I'll whisk. and then I'm gonna start pouring in our buttermilk. Okay. So we need to get all of these ingredients incorporated. You can go ahead and pour those eggs in. In. Okay. We're gonna mix this now. I'm gonna let you mix it, and then right. we're gonna talk about the most important step which is this pan. It has got to be as hot as the hinges of hell. Just, I'm not playing. It's, it's got to be really, really, really hot. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right, uh, so this is a beautiful it? cast iron skillet. It does have um, some oil in it, and I'm okay. gonna pour that in. Now this is hot, so move back. We don't wanna, right. yeah. I don't wanna burn you. No, yeah, now, yesterday I almost woo, died of smoking. Uh, you did, I okay. saw that. Yeah, so yeah. then what you're gonna do is pour your batter in here, okay. and then the I pan to is gonna go back. Though, right? Exactly, okay. mix it, mix it, mix it. Now. Okay. We have our sauteed going. vegetables. Yes. We are moving on to the best part, which is the cornbread dressing. Okay. I've got sage. I have poultry seasoning and a little bit of cayenne. Okay. And we're going to saute this for about two minutes. You really want that flavor to get mm -hmm. in there. Yeah. Um, and so we take our sauteed vegetables. Mm -hmm. I'm pouring this and, in. Uh, yeah, that's perfect. Okay. And then um, we're going to add them to our cracker crumbs. Oh, okay. Now, this is the cornbread. Yes, that you Just made Just a little this. bit later. Yes. Exactly. So we're going to add that to this, mm -hmm. and then we have our eggs. Now, okay. now, but before we do that, let's talk about this real quick. We do want to go ahead and add the chicken broth, mm -hmm. and then we're going to taste this. We have to make sure that this is right, because literally, if we sit down on Thanksgiving Day, yes. and these seasonings aren't correct, yep. then the whole day is ruined. Okay. So you want to taste, taste it, it, before you it, commit. and then um, we're going to bake it at 350, oh and my look gosh. at that fantasticness. Talk to me, baby. Okay. Isn't that good? It looks so good. All right, Jocelyn, what are we making? All right, so we took cornbread, and, you know, it had a cake bake. Okay. Yes. This is what we got. So we got some butter in here, and we got some sugar, and you want to cream this. You want to add as much air to this, cream this as much as possible. Okay. We're going to add our eggs in one at a time because you want to make sure this is a nice and silky batter, okay? okay? And then you want to slow this baby down because as soon as you start adding in your cornmeal mm -hmm. and your flour, you want to make sure that this does not overdevelop. Okay. Anything, you want to just make sure it's nice, light, and fluffy. So once we've got our vanilla in, we've got our buttermilk, that makes a nice, moist cake. Okay. We've got our batter here. Beautiful and it comes batter. out perfect. You got I that mean, Cast iron pan. Oh my gosh, you got this cast iron because you cannot have a country Thanksgiving yes. without a cast iron skillet, it. okay? So then you're going to put this right in here in our cast iron skillet. Yep. You're going to bake this baby up. It comes out so delicious, mm -hmm. so moist. Uh, you can even put it in a cake pan if you want to do that. You can do these cute little little mini buns. Oh my gosh, you can do whatever you want, that okay? That is not that difficult. And this is not I think I can do this. Elizabeth okay, and Jocelyn, right. thank you so much. They're back on November 23rd along <laughs> with 30 other chefs. Free Thanksgiving celebration on the plaza. All the recipes today.com. Hello, today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.